we're now going to talk about how we can calculate the energy of earthquakes. And the way that this works is there's a formula out there that says that the log of the energy is equal to 4.4 plus 1.5 times the magnitude of the earthquake. And again, remember, magnitude is the m is what we were using with our Richter scale. It's the magnitude. How big does this feel? The energy, though, is how much energy the Earth is actually producing at the time. So how much energy is being used? And so we want to, real quick, get rid of the E. So we're going to get, we raise every, 10 to the everything. And that gives me E equals 10 to the 4.4 plus 1.5 M, which is going to be equal to 10 to the 0.4 times 10 to the 4 times 10 to the 1.5 M. I'm taking advantage of the fact that this is 4 plus 0.4 plus 1.5 M and breaking it into three separate ten powers of 10. Well, this is approximately equal. 10 to the 0.4 is approximately equal to 2.5. 10 raised to the point 0.4. That's close enough to 2.5 that that's what we're going to use. Times 10 to the 4th times 10 to the 1.5 amps. So if I know what m is, then I can figure out how much energy was released. And so that's what we're going to use. And what we're going to do is we're going to look at two different earthquakes. The one in Japan of 2011, which was a 9.0 on the Richter scale, and the Iran earthquake in 1997, which is a 7.5. And we're going to compare these. So we want to know Ej is equal to 2.5 times 10 to the 4th times 10 to the 1.5 times 9. Let me write that a little bit better. 0.5 times 9, which is 2.5 times 10 to the 4th times 10 raised to the 1.5 times 9, which is this number right here. So we take 7905, 694, 1504, 209, 4, 8, 3, 2. You can see how big that number is. That's why we like talking about the magnitude instead. The 9 represents all of that. And so I'm going to hold on to this one for a minute. Let's look at EM, which is going to be equal to 2.5 times 10 to the 4th times 10 to the 1.5 times 7.5 which is approximately equal to 2.5 times 10 to the 4th times 10 raised to the 1.5 times 7.5 equals quite a bit smaller number. 5, 6, 9, 8, 5, 2, 5, 0, 9, 7, 3, 7. 7307. See, I missed a digit. But what I really want is a comparison. What is EJ over EM? Well, there's some good news here. 2.5 times 10 to the 4th times 10 to the 9 times 1.5 is 13.5 divided by 2.5 times 10 to the 4th times 10 to the 1.5 times 7.5 is 11.25. Notice that there's something nice that those will divide out, so I don't need to actually divide these numbers. I need to divide these numbers, which is equal to 10 to the 13.5 over 11, 10 to the 11.25, 10 to the 13.5 minus 11.25, which gives me 2.25, 10 to the 2.25. So we come back down here, we raise this to the 2.25 power, and we get that Ej is equal to approximately 177.8 EM. The energy expended in Japan was almost 200 times more energy than was done in Iran.
And so that's how we can compare energies by calculating them. And notice that if we know that we're only dealing with energies, then this constant piece divides out. 